hi guys thank you so much for clicking on this video today i'm going to show you how to make the cutest face pots for your indoor plants this diy is so easy to follow and you can make it yourself at home if you're new to my channel please subscribe for more and turn on the notifications so i will see you next time so guys, I bought these pots from the Dollar Tree and 99 cent store. So you need to pair your pots together, top one for the face and the bottom one for the base. We need to remove the price tag stickers and felt pads at the bottom of the pot. And you would need any glue that can bond ceramics or porcelain. So you need to apply an amount of glue on the bottom of each pot and stick them together put pressure on the top of the pot using your hands to put them together and in place Let the glue or adhesive air dry for 24 hours. To create a face, you can use a paper pattern, cut out as a guide, a pencil, or a Sharpie marker to make an outline. For painting your face pot, you can use any acrylic paint. Materials used for this project will be listed in the description box of this video. Always do a second coating on your painting to make the color vivid and vibrant. So now we have two pots ready for face painting. So guys, keep on watching and follow along. Guys, the design that I'm using for this face pot is called Harajuku. It's a famous street fashion in Japan years back. I'm just trying to revive it because I believe the street fashion called Harajuku is not over. It's not dead. It's just there and wearing a different mask. Just like wearing a different face mask. My Harajuku face pot doesn't have a nose, just like Hello Kitty doesn't have a mouth. So there should be some meaning to it. If one of you knows the meaning, please write a comment down below.
painting over black you have to really make two coatings of paint to make it visible So guys, let's now make a red hair Harajuku. So guys, to make the eyes, you just make a circle like a dot and then increase the size gradually and make a line going outwards in a slant motion and just make two lashes at the end. And the lips make it full heart shape and red in color. Harajuku women like wearing fashionable and colorful accessories of different designs. So I'm adding a bow to this red haired Harajuku. The next face pot is using a mug for the top and a pot for the base. So this is a ceramic mug. So we need to use acrylic paint and we can only use a marker to outline this particular face pot. When I bought this mug, it has a design at the back, so I need to paint over it with black to cover and hide the design. And guys, when you're picking colors for your face pot, if you're a beginner, 
try to refer to the color wheel like for example purple goes well with yellow or orange or green and with yellow combined with black it makes the color stand out Since these face pots don't have any drainage holes, you can use it as a decorative double pot for your indoor plants or succulents. Another video I will be showing on how to grow and plant succulents on pots and containers without drainage holes and give some care tips. So guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, Please subscribe for more and turn on the notifications so I'll be seeing you next time. I hope you enjoyed watching this DIY video on how to make a face pot or portrait planter. Thank you so much for watching.